Good evening. Good evening, welcome to the live coverage of the Predator Germany Open. It's day three here at the beautiful Atlantic Hotel in Bremen, Germany. Our, f our last match for today is between Daidat Muhammad and Mario He. Alongside with me in the commentary booth is Marcus Schama, the legendary uh, Moscone Cup team captain <laughs> and professional player by himself. Hello, Marcus. Yeah, hi. Uh, what a nice matchup! What a nice matchup we have here. Of course, I really see a scratch here. We just started with yeah. a scratch. <laughs> right, right back at you. Um, yeah, thanks, uh, Ralph. Uh, what exciting tournament this has been so far, and it's just getting better and better. Obviously, this tournament is not uh, possible without yes, sponsors, and I. To start, I want to start with mention them, and they are Predator Cues, of obviously, Relive, uh, CSI from the US, Kamui, Tips, Alpha Coin, and, our, and the local partners are Telecom Communications and HBI. And we are so excited about seeing this young man from Austria, Mr. Mario here for the last match of the night. He's such a great talent and a really young, still young and a nice, uh, humble guy, guy in my opinion. Very humble, humble person, yeah. absolutely. And uh, yeah, normally he don't need much of an introduction. He's uh, absolutely regular since uh, quite some years on the tour worldwide. And uh, what was the biggest achievement? He has a lot of European titles on yeah, him. Yeah, I, 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 I spoke to him uh, <laughs> just before the match, and I said, "What, what, what is your, like, what is your uh, biggest achievement? Like, let sit that mm -hmm. sits on your heart. What was the one that meant the most?" He said, "The second uh, world, uh, this the, the second time he won the World Cup of pool because he was." Some kind of he, he was banned. He mm -hmm. said for six months, for some reason, and and he was uh, uh, at that point uh, in his in his career that I I uh, wanted to prove something, and and, and he mm -hmm. won the World Cup, and just after that he won the Euro Tour. He said, and that was that was my big so far the biggest achievement. He said, that's great. As Absolutely. far as you know his career so far and it's way it's not it's he's got a lot of tournaments ahead of him yeah on the other side we got mr muhammad daydad he's originally from south africa but lives in switzerland in the last uh, five <coughs> years he started at the age of 15 now he's 40 mm. so quite some experience what was the highest achievement uh, that he was mentioning to you? Well, he told me he only played pool for uh, four years. Before he's been, he play played he's been playing uh, English, English eight ball. Yeah, English, the yeah. UK rules, English eight ball. And uh, I asked him who's the, his favorite player. He said uh, uh, the coach of uh, the coach of Ronnie mm. O'Sullivan. Is that right? <laughs> Jay Ray, Ray. He said he won the, the World Snooker Championship seven times. Is I that said, right? who? J <laughs> so I said, <laughs> and he took his phone out and he, 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 he was Googling it. <coughs> Googling it. <coughs> All right. And he said, uh, Jay really helped uh, Ron Zal's game and, and so on. But I guess we got to know if... <coughs> If somebody wins the World Snooker Championships six times, except Ronnie and uh, Stephen Henry. So here we have our humble Mario He sitting in his chair, getting to the table for his second break. Because while we were talking about all the titles, yeah. he was running, running out smoothly through the whole rack. The thing he does best to run out. There's a view of data. South Africa. 
Near the breaking with, a, with an open bridge. Interesting. He got both balls, which are located behind the one, a little bit long. We saw them a lot of times coming short, right? Open yeah, bridge. Seven and eight. Nice break with the open bridge. Amazing. Okay, the eight didn't move Still didn't make any balls. Seven was long, eight didn't move at all, but they did. got a shot on the one. What do you think? Natural roll and he might come straight back to the two? Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna avoid some uh, five and nine here, some kind of way mm -hmm. to come down. And the side pocket's in the way as well. Yeah, that's why he shouldn't use too much spin here. It is nice one, yeah, just, just past the 5-9. He's got a shot on the 2, which is not the easiest one. A lot of angle there. Have you been to South Africa? No, never been. You? Yeah, no, I've never been there. They had a few players. Yes, sir. Oh, he's playing. In the he's calling the side pocket, so... 10 seconds. Safety, I guess. Probably Central a two-way shot, maybe hiding <laughs> but hmm. yeah. he wanted to hide a cue ball behind a 10 but if he would have made a two ball then he would be in trouble right mm -hmm. <laughs> so Mario back at the table Open shot, but not easy. Get position on the three. Yeah, naturally the cue ball goes to the right. Ten seconds. And you don't want a power shot like that, right? <laughs> <laughs> Makes it pretty, pretty you hard. Move every ball on the table, pretty much. Yeah, that wasn't easy. He tried to jack up and uh, swing the, the cube around. So Data need, needs to get a good position on the three ball. I guess pretty much the natural. The eight nine roll. is kind of in the way here. With some Four left seconds. side. Oh. oh. Missed the shot. Unusual miss here. For Mario, he just pointed with his cue how much down he has to come with the cue ball. And the middle pocket, he's not trusting that, so mm -hmm. he's going high and missing again. For sure difficult, but Normally you don't see Mario hey, missing that much, right? No. Yeah, there was a... Maybe he took his eye off the ball a little bit and uh, tried to create that angle so he can make the three. Dadat. Back at the table and he couldn't get position for the three, so he he have to play safe here. That's a nice close-up here, so you yeah. really can see the, the shape, shape of his leather. Look at the nice uh, logo for the Predator balls here. Yeah. I really like the balls. Yeah. They are... Uh, I've been playing with them back home. They play nice. And they look nice. I'm looking Colors forward. Colors are back from the, you know, old school. Yeah. Looking forward to receive my first set anytime okay. soon. So here's the long three, three ball for Mario. Mistake again. That's very unusual. But Mario doesn't, it's not a lot of time you see him miss two kind of easy shots for him. This is a pretty much, pretty much natural follow, unless you want to screw it, I mean, draw it. Oh, no. 
Ay, ay, ay. <coughs> they feel the pressure, maybe. <laughs> but Mario <coughs> is normally pretty used to be on the center court, right? Yeah, uh, it was some movement there. Yeah, data certainly showed some movement. Yeah, he was all right. over the place, and you can't, you can't move too much on the on the on the shot because then it's gonna affect the way you deliver on the on the cue ball. Usually, a sign when you tensed up so much your muscles, uh, usually a sign that you are emotionally pretty involved here which is on the one hand pretty nice but on the other hand it doesn't help the technique so he's making sure he got a good angle on the seven to where he can float down to make the eight in the lower left corner pocket In the middle of the table, he'll be fine. Even better, it's perfect. Yeah, that's the Mario here, I know. <laughs> <laughs> down 10 in the side pocket a 2-0 lead for Mr. Mario here we will be back and we are off for a short break So here we are back, and Mario he is, yeah, he's going from the side break. He was trying before from the center, didn't he? Yeah. All right. So it's uh. Wow, powerful. Made but on the eight ball. Mm -hmm. And. like a cut version but unusual a lot of power 
but a good result. Unless if, I mean, the nine ball is disturbing a little bit, certainly. Yeah, he, he needs to use the bridge. See if we can make the one and then play a two six combination there. Get jacked up over this ball here. That's the worst himself. spot you <laughs> could be <laughs> That's the worst spot you could be in. Anything but there, he was probably thinking. Yes, sir. There he realized it. So it's a one rail kick here. He has to avoid Ten the foul. Seconds. Nice hit. Yeah make contact on the two and let's see what Mr. Uh, it, was a it was a nice kick shot there to make contact you know it was an easy let's see what so Mr. Day 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 that is going to do out of that he needs to do something in order for the, for him not get this match slip out of his hand Ten seconds extension please He needed to come close to the other side pocket, maybe with a lot of left side spin, right? To come. Looks like he's shooting it in the side. Mm -hmm. I would prefer the corner. I think come out in a long rail and then yeah. out to the left side of Ten the table seconds. and shoot yeah. three in the corner. Yeah, I agree. Like so. More spin he need or oh, nice. Oh he's going for the gap found for a the gap window there between yeah. a six and a nine. Requires good speed control here. That's nice. Four is in the opposite side of the table. Oh. He missed it unfortunately. The three. After that nice shot, he missed that one. Yeah, you can't give uh, Mario these opportunities. You need to really take take your chances once you have them. Just enough space to pass the six. He tried to pass it five. for the same pocket. What do you think? Let's see what he like to do here. Yes, sir. Extension, please. He took an extension. Trying to decide what he's going to do. Either he plays a carom, five on to, uh, the cube will in into, into the, the seven. five, into the seven, or he's just gonna shoot five in the corner. He's using his left hand. Looks like a carom. Missed, tried a missed carom. the carom. Yeah, it was. Uh, it wasn't easy. Here's another opportunity for they that. The funny thing is, those caroms, when they when they are successful, they look pretty easy, right? Yeah. But they are not. Yes, sir. He's playing the seven.
good execution to leave the six ball in front of the pocket after this combination. Floating up nicely for the nine. <coughs> Yeah, um, he's ra raising his cue a little bit, trying mm -hmm. to shoot nine inside. Very short stroke here. Yeah. Down goes the ten, and it's a two-one lead for Mario. In our race to four. Yes. Our favorite format. Race to four, two winning sets. Winner breaks. He had a Predator Pro Billiard Series in Bremen at the beautiful Atlantic Hotel. Maybe a little extra shout out I like to give to the HBI sponsor because they they put always in the morning a nice basket with fruits and some some sweets here. okay <laughs> yeah they keep us alive you know? <laughs> <laughs> i have to give a shout out to them that's nice uh, je uh jester from them there it is you see hb okay immobilia So here's a break from Daydot. Here's the view of the, the new uh, Predator tables that they are been launching, that they're play, playing really good, and they, they, they've been putting a lot of work to, imp to improve everything. 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 They're not missing a detail. Uh, Absolutely, I especially like the uh, coating they put on the on the frame. Yeah. So it feels real, really comfortable. Yeah. And it's almost impossible to leave some dirt or some dot there. Yeah, you, you can. Have sweaty fingers. Yeah, even when you have chalk there or something, it brushes off. It goes away. <laughs> so the table stays uh, like it looks like like it's brand new the whole time. Really amazing. Day dot. He's not wasting much time. He's gonna try to tie this set up at two apiece. The three ball. The red three. Now he's getting a little bit more warmed up here. Yeah. Um, uh, Quite a difference to his beginning. Yeah. Ten seconds. Oh. With a little help from He the didn't nine want the notch on the nine. He wanted to miss the notch and uh, get a nice and easier shot on the six. Now he's got a go kind of a more difficult cut and still he's going to try to get position on the seven. Da -da. And here nice it goes. Shot. Okay, frozen to the rail, but... So let's see if he comes lower on the eight or he's trying to come above. Uh, Ten seconds. He's above. coming above, nice. So here is just. With the stop shot, he got the perfect angle to go naturally down to yeah. the 10, right? <coughs> Ten seconds. Oof. Oh. Let's put 
putting some pressure on himself using the whole 30 second shot clock that we're using here. I guess he He's kind of yeah. forcing himself to Extension, please. Yeah. to re really get you know cute on the on the cue ball. You know, I guess. I guess he really wanted to, to make sure to come out of the rail. So opportunity for Mario. Eight ball, let's make it. Landed a little bit too far than he wanted to. He have to come down, down table and up. Preference, I guess, where you're gonna be. Well, two choices. I mean, after the short rail contact, he can go pretty like he goes high One, and two. natural down. But he could have also put Three. a lot of left side yeah. spin in it and a little draw to go the other way around. Nice positionals up there. Down goes the 10 and 3-1 lead for Mario. Kind of a gift from him. We'll be back in a minute. So we're back here uh, for the last match of the third day. It's Mario here from Austria against Daydat from South Africa. <coughs> Mr. Mario here is leading three games to one in the first set. We're playing a two set format, races to four. If the two sets are split one set apiece, then we go to a shootout. And so far, it has been a kind of a struggle. Both players kind of been struggling, I guess. What do you think, yeah, Ralph? A little bit in the beginning, especially. Yeah. Day that was he's gonna make uh, tidy this set up at two apiece. Unfortunately, he missed uh, kind of a kind of easy two uh, eight ball. Uh -huh. Eight, nine, ten left. And uh, Mario executed well to get make those last three balls, and now we find find himself three one lead. 
and running out to try to win the first set there. It's pretty hard to maneuver around the balls here for the four ball. Yeah, he's got the four in the corner. A little yes, cut here, he's come up in the center of the table, I guess. Mm -hmm. Like so. A little bit hard. Still okay. Mario is a good shooter, so it shouldn't be a problem for him. Extension, please. Using his extension, he's making sure that he doesn't make any silly mistakes because of the shot clock. Nice shot, delivers well. Get himself back in line. Yeah, he uh, he's got all the tools. Mario does. Mm -hmm. Big player. First time I saw him, he was already in the juniors division. Okay. <laughs> And they already recognized him as a big talent back then. I guess, yeah, we talk about 2006 or seven or so. Mm -hmm. Here it is, nice view on the table. Two diamond draw shot. No problem there in the back of the pocket. He hit it. Back of the pocket, I'm talking in the middle of the pocket. <laughs> then it makes that, s that sound. I really like also the sound of the table. Yeah. Right? They changed the pocket uh, material three times. Yeah, we spoke to uh, the CEO of uh, Predator, Mr. Kareem, today, and uh, the, C the CEO. Of okay, we'll be back. We'll speak uh, more about this table. So here we are back at our arena, the Predator Pro Billiard Series. And 
And Mario here just collected the first set and is opening now the second set with this break. Powerful break again. But this time nothing on the break. He has to leave the table to Mr. Data from South Africa, currently living in the Switzerland. And let's see what he got. Long, Long opening one ball. Yeah. Difficult shot, especially with queuing over the four ball. Yeah, we were speaking about the, the pockets. They uh, the CEO of uh, Predator, Mr. Kareem. Mm -hmm. He said they changed the the uh, the material of the of the of the of the, the pocket three of times. The pocket, yeah. Just in order to make it to where it doesn't. For example, uh, sometimes you have problems to uh, that they produce yeah. dots on the on the balls, yeah. right? When you shoot them hard, into yeah. Them, right? There it is, uh, uh, a yeah. picture of the pocket C. So they changed it three times in order to make it exactly the way they want it. And here's a nice view of it. Uh, really nice. That's how per th that's how much time and effort yes, they're sir. making the money, obviously, o on the on the table to make it exactly perfect to where they, they, the way they make they want they want it to be so and it's a nice combination it's trying to clip the four and the best thing is the money they make out of those tables will be will go back into the tour yeah even better yeah awesome they put also a special designed little pillow <laughs> uh, like in the bottom part of the pocket, so it reduces the noise. Yeah, we and can see on top here, you can see yeah. like a small little uh, yeah. uh, pocket there where it's I it doesn't make the sound uh, of the balls here. And it prevents the balls from coming out of the pocket. Sometimes mm. it happens when you shoot hard into it, right? So, who came up with that safety? It's trying to jump over the eight. Into and the rail and rail, hit the rail and then into the one. And try to puck it, the one. That's a very delicate mission here. Let's see that. Yeah, oh, good not try. Not too bad, not too bad. Good yeah. try. Might <coughs> Maybe he's trying to put out, pull out another safety here, or side pocket. Ten seconds. Safety. Safety from Mr. He. You wanted to see another jump One, shot. I wonder if he's going to jump it or he's going to kick at it. He's he's selecting to get his jump cue. He's making it even shorter. Look at this. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Using a beautiful predator jump cue. Ten seconds. Ten seconds left. Well, legal hit, but. Mario back at the table. Yes, sir. Hmm. Mm, I didn't know what they call there. Was he trying to play safe? I guess. Yeah, most likely. But I haven't seen the call either. <laughs> so data electing to play safe. 
He certainly put distance into those two balls, mm -hmm. and that's a nice. That's There's a no safety. jump available here, is it? <laughs> no. <laughs> if he doesn't jump over and then jump over again. Maybe a triple, triple. Maybe jump we can see a triple <laughs> jump here. <laughs> He's got his jump cue. Who knows? Well, if he nope. just goes for the long yeah. rail right before the side pocket, he might get it over. He's gonna two kick rails. one rail. One. Oh, one rail only. Oh, good try. Good hit from Mario. <coughs> but left, Mr. Data. A shot. I thought about two rails. Now the four or five is in the way, so he needs to use the bridge on top of his balls. Ten seconds. Seven. Six. Oh, he's playing safe, okay. Oh no. Oh. That's the star disaster. Because Morris got a straight in shot on the two here. That's not the start he wanted in this second set. No. <laughs> but the safety was good, the plan was good, the idea was good. But then, unluckily, he forgot that there is a middle pocket available. I think you should go for a shot there. Just make the one and, and come around. Yeah. Right? Why not? Even if you don't get perfect position, at least you're at the table. You don't want to, you don't want to leave the the table over to your opponent. Mario, come up one rail. Six ball. Perfect angle on it. So he's going to come into the 9 with the cube here. Try to remove the 9 out of the way and get a shot on the... There you go. Get a shot on the 8. He's not too happy about it, I guess. Because the cue ball <laughs> is a natural way we would go into the 9 and... Come know, on, Mario. Don't, don't be so picky. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you, you, you shoot so good. Don't worry about it. See? Yeah. There you go. and the first game will go to Mr. Mario here from Austria. He's going to be up 1-0 in the second set. And Mr. Daydat, he needs uh, to really, if he gets opportunity at the table, he needs to take it, <coughs> put it that way. Yeah, yeah. Because you can't just... Uh, you cannot uh, beat those guys just playing defense. No, no, no. You have to attack, attack at some point. Take your opportunity once you have them. <coughs> Mr. John Lehman, again our referee from New York. New York, yeah? Yeah, New York. Yeah, he's usually uh, the tournament leader at the... The straight pool event there, right? Eh? Yes. From many so. years ago. Mm -hmm. And he runs a league at Amsterdam Billiards. Okay. The famous pool hall in downtown New York. He was an actor as well, right? He was an actor as well, yes. See? Professional actor. Professional <laughs> <laughs> He's still an actor. Look at him. He's maybe always at the he's uh, on TV here with the pool. Maybe he's just acting to be a referee, <laughs> you know? <laughs> <laughs> Did anybody check his license? <laughs> so, break from Mario, making Great. the one in the side. Yeah, that Let's see if he's going to get a shot on the two. No. Ah, he's hooked maybe. Yeah. I think the seven is in the way in order for him to 
to shoot the two six combination. Big shot called. Big break from Mario here. Yeah, he's always been one of the best breakers in the, in Europe for the last few years, I think, in my opinion. I played him some eight ball mm -hmm. at the European Championships, and he crushes them balls. Real powerful break. What do you think about that offer? He, is it a bank offer? Uh, if the two is froze, then... Him uh, he's, ba he's banking. He's calling the bank. Ten seconds. You can use the extension by le le oh. oh foul. He missed the whole Yeah. Data this is kind of rattled from this. Oh boy. That's not a mistake you wanna do against a player of Mario's caliber. <laughs> Giving a player Giving a top player, ball in hand. Class player, ball in hand. Here's the cloth. Ten seconds. You can really see up uh, when they when they zoom in with the camera about the cloth. A real uh, nice and uh, the color is beautiful. Mario, watch out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he almost hooked himself behind the seven there. Well, I guess we all know we were in that situation when, he had, when we had a wide open table. Sometimes we are looking, where can we create a problem yeah. here? And then you create it from nowhere. Mm. Yeah. Three, four is the... It's next, it's by the spot here. Purple four goes down. Watch out. He's flirting again with <laughs> flirting <laughs> again with the <laughs> seven ball. <laughs> Still got a shot five in the side. He's just making sure where he wants to go with the cue ball. He's gonna elect to go three rails around and shoot seven in the, in the side pocket, I think I would guess. Yeah, he has to land pretty Just make sure he misses the, the, the 10 and 9. Mm -hmm. Right in between them he needs to hit the rail. One, two, three. There you Perfect. Yeah, there's no real weaknesses in in Morris game. Yeah. I w I would think I, I don't know what what uh, I sa you know I'm not saying he hasn't won a lot of things, but he just what what was the difference from him not being uh, where uh, Shane Van Boning, Joshua Filler, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. you know, uh, well, Kupini, the, the all these players is winning all these tournaments. The I mean, he's winning yeah. tournaments as well, but but. Uh, mm -hmm. Consist yeah. Consistency, yeah. doing it every day, every week, every month, you know. Absolutely. Two nothing it goes for Mario. But if you want to know, well, if you the closer you come to the top, the harder it is to find yeah. any weakness, right? You need to work even harder once you're there. Yeah, but uh, if, if you want to find it out, you might take a closer look to the opponents he lost to. So maybe you search for the internet, which, who are the players he's going to lose? Nowadays we have a lot of statistics in the internet, right? You might find it out and maybe there are some similarities in the, in the way the opponents play or their playing style. Maybe there you can find something. Right, 
let's check out the break if he can get the one ball another time in the side pocket and look how powerful it is bang close to the side pocket he got the four ball hmm. Yeah, he's kind of cutting them from the side and cutting uh, cutting them a little bit. Mm -hmm. And he's making balls. He's not getting shots, but at least he's making a ball and and have the you know, yeah. the first shot. And that's important as well. I mean, he might elect to try to get play a safety here behind the five. Like so. I think he left a shot though. Maybe. I don't know. Let's see if the camera can get us a view, a look of it. Yeah, oh, it goes. Wide open, yeah. It looked like cover. So data he really needs to take a chance here. Otherwise, this is going to slip out of his hands. Oh, no. Mm. That's not it. That's not how you come back from these. Do you think the, the main table is affecting data if it's not used to it? Yes, sir. Yeah, I guess so. Ten huh? seconds. I think so. Extension, please. I mean, I don't know. Who did you play it in the beginning? You, you, know, you know, sometimes it's like uh, s some players are really... Oh, Karam. Oh, nice Karam here from Mario. Ooh. The one into the ten. Yeah, uh, sometimes actually, you know, these kind of table it's on the main table when it's televised and, and, and cameras it can affect you really negative you know if, yeah. if you're not all there well, it can I remember my, my first Euro tour I beat Sandro Tot from Hungary and then I beat Thomas Engert and I was in the quarterfinal and uh, if I would have won the next match I would have played on, on uh, the TV table I was playing Mika Imbon and, and I was thinking in my head, I don't want to win this match because I don't want to play on the TV. I never played in front of, you know, like on, really? a, on a main table because it was televised. The semifinals was televised, uh -huh. you know. So I lost on purpose. Yeah. You know, like I was too nervous to play on. <laughs> <laughs> like if I would have won it, then I, I want to play the semifinal on the TV. So I said, or I didn't say, but I, in my mind, I remember it very, uh, very clear that that's it was too. It would have been too nervous to to play on TV, so I wasn't ready for it. Watch out, the cue ball might scratch you. Yeah. It was successful on the one ball. <laughs> yeah, there was. But later on, obviously, sooner or later, I had to play on a, 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 a televised <laughs> table or a main table, and it it worked out fine. And then there was this so monkey had to take off my back, uh, you know. Yeah, you finally started to like that spotlight. Yeah, I like that spotlight. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Once you're there, it's like uh, you want to be there the whole time. If if you're playing good, uh, if you're not feeling well, it's the worst yeah. place. You don't want to be there. <laughs> well, it will affect you, sometimes in a positive or in a negative way. Yeah. Right? As far as... cold. They that had his, his opportunities, just the matter he have to cap capitalize on them. So it's a push out from Mario. Is that your option? I guess that's a pretty good offer, isn't it? Especially since the six ball is sitting there. Yeah. Oh no, the two. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I, well, I forgot the two ball. I just saw the three ball, you know. Okay. I'm wrong here. Yes, sir. He's going for a bank. Two ball. The two ball he's gonna bank in the corner. It's the day that checking up. Oh, that's from because he jacked up so much. He got away with it though. He didn't leave Mario a opening <laughs> shot. Mario is calling the two in the side pocket. 
Yeah, you can hit either way hit it perfect or get some help from the five. Oof. Came close to making it. Yeah. <coughs> Didn't leave they that an easy shot. Yeah, I think, uh, what shot would you play here, Central Rolf? Maybe a carom into the two. The carom two no, into, into the, into the six. The, yeah, two yeah. into the six. But <laughs> I'm not sure if this is the yeah, best Yeah, just, 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 just uh, whip it, yeah. hit it hard. Make two into the uh, carom. Let's see if you get, uh, he's trying to play safe, the cue ball behind the nine. <coughs> The six. He's calling the six just in case. It's checked up over the ball here. Nice camera view. Here you see. Beautiful camera view here. Yes, yeah. Ten seconds. He's made the six, I think. That's what Which he called. Which he that your huh. option? No, he didn't call that. No, he called the six. Oh, he didn't call. He didn't. Because it's his yeah. option. He gave it back to him. <laughs> Let's see what Mario is going to do. Yes, sir. He called it two Ten ball. Seconds. Two ball on the corner. Two rails. Yeah, that was tough. Mm. The zigzag. It's always hard to judge. So, Mr. Mohammed died at last call, huh? Last call. <laughs> last call for him. <laughs> you need to take it opportunity and run out here. If you don't, you will be in tr big trouble. I think the three just passes the nine, I guess. Ten seconds. Yeah, get close there. That's nice. Nice. Try to roll down so you have the four in the side pocket. Yes, sir. Like so. Shooting the four on the side. Let's see if he's shooting the five in the corner or he wants to shoot the five in the side, maybe. Also, he's shooting in the corner. Nice. From South Africa. Living in Switzerland now. Switzerland. The past five years. Have you played? He plays English. He used to play English eight ball. Mm -hmm. Have you ever played it? No. Never <laughs> tried it. Yeah. No. I tried it. and I'm horrible at it. It's difficult. <laughs> <laughs> the balls are very small. Oh no. Oh. They missed that opportunity. Yeah. yeah, the balls are very small, like like a golf ball, mm -hmm. and you, c <laughs> you know, it's <laughs> it's like uh, I don't know. I the cue ball has a different size, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, the cue ball. I think the cue ball is even smaller than the <laughs> object balls. Very difficult, but it's and big in the, in England and a small table in right? the UK and Scotland and Wales. Yeah, yeah. So two more balls away from the match from Mario. Super Mario. One, two. Perfect. Three ra rails down. And the match to Mario here from Austria. <laughs> this will close day three. Thank you very much for today, Ralph. We will be it's back. been some exciting games. We're Four. looking for, uh, forward to tomorrow's game already.
Please check Let's out our lineup as soon yeah. as we got it. It it's will be online. Be on the website. Excited to see you guys tomorrow or listen to you guys. Listen Thank to you us. Very much. Listen to you. Thank you very much. Good night. Good night.